hand and deck. Fight! This guy's been really, really solid. Bruh. Come on, guys. Alright, looks like we're doing just a little part of this live, which is I'm gonna I wanna do the Ascension 25 uh train stuff today. So everything these are full unlocked, but the cards aren't. Why is Jorbs' icon still above my icon? What is the point of doing all this installation process if my icon is not now higher than his icon? Please. I've been I've been lied to and cheated. And then uh I wanted to try this. All right, we're going to start a new run. We have three new factions we've never even tried. Three. Oh, it's two new. Two new in a random clan. Thank you, Didiki. Or maybe we'll open this up on stream so we can look together what it is. All right, this is the... Uh, let me find the web browser. You guys. Yeah, okay. So this is... No, I'll make it bigger. Enemies are stronger. Add additional random cards to your starting deck. Add dead weight to your starting deck. Major battles have additional enemies. Minor bosses have increased damage. Minor. HP. Your pirate takes 20 damage at the start of the run. That's 40 total, and Seraph now has 1,000 plus HP. Thanks. Okay. I want to try these new factions. Look at this guy. This guy is. I, this, I would like to be this guy. He looks super fucking cool. Bruh. Pretty nice round. Let's see what our fight is. <sighs> okay. Enemy appear on each floor for 150 coins. So can our health support that? These fuckers are stealth too. So we can't kill them when they do that. So we'd have to AoE them. We don't have AoEs. I don't think we can do that. It's too bad. 150 is a lot. Shrunk the top room. Wombo combo requires five. There's only four there. So we're wombo comboing second room. We have 23 cards in our deck. One of them makes the room bigger. Downside, I don't really want to be on third room. Third, third, the problem with third floor is it grows us one turn slower, right? Which is kind of nasty. I think I want to put them in here. It's a lot of damage though. We will draw some cards this turn by playing three. Okay, kind of rough round. I don't think at the moment we survived the stealthers, right? They're doing too much damage. They're doing 30. Okay, we did get paid off for deploying up there. We got to figure out how to keep this alive. We can summon to the front, I guess. But only one spot. Okay. Still don't have a fucking answer. A lot of damage coming in again. Okay, that helps. That removes 10. This guy gets armor when we cast spells. No, and unit gets armor when we kill this. We can make him stay here though. Okay. All right, boss shows up. A renewal. Thank you, Jagger. Welcome back. All right, we have did draw a mind collapse. Might change the math over here. We'll see. Our dude's pretty beefy right now. Uh, Glimmer is really good here. Leading with that seems pretty solid. So the problem is what? We're not getting enough lifesteal because we haven't eaten any dudes. Did we draw the shit card? We didn't even manage to draw the shit card right now. That feels bad. So you just need to grow. So feeding you is fine. This will take all of my actions in here though. Can live with that. 
Okay, we still didn't draw the fucking card that gives us lifelink off immediately. We just drew four more of these things. It feels really bad. Okay. Oh, dude, this is not good enough. You need a lifelink one, right? Mind collapse, do anything here. This unit takes five. It needs to be in intervals of 30. It's currently at... Um, so it's going to gain 13 to that. It's going to go to, what is that, 72? So I can't do 12 to it. I could do 9 to it. If I hadn't cast that spell, I could do 12 to it, but it doesn't change anything. So we're taking 18 on the core. Heater gains damage. Would have been a better one to cast here. I guess we keep fishing for better dudes. Heater gains damage shield. That's good. We want the lifelink hitting. Lifelink's on strike. Doesn't really change much, actually. Space is a fucking issue here, huh? Oh, it's gonna. This guy's gonna get a damage shield. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Not a very good turn for us. Oh, he's got stealth eight anyways. Doesn't matter. I forgot about stealth eight. Doing things that didn't matter down there. Almost kill him. Probably kill him with this outright. Of course we don't draw any ability to summon minions. Lol, lol, lol. I gotta play three cards then, I guess. Immune to root. Does it still count as playing? Yes. It's fine. Have a million mana. Okay, we win the fight now. Still a rough fight. Yeah. Took a lot of damage from those tanky boys. Okay. Apply damage shield two, rage six, and ember drain three. It's interesting. The unit does not die though with that. Consume apply trample. Yes, yes, we want that. We want that. Let me trample. Alright. Consume apply spikes, don't care. Consume draw three, that I care about. Okay. Alright, uh, we want to get a spell upgrade that's there, although this has removal, duplicate, and healing. Oh my god. The root I'm gonna probably play almost every single time, right? Because I want the draw plus one. I don't want it sitting in my hand doing nothing. It's cost zero, I can play it, but I, this way I don't have to draw it again. Like it's not useful. I mean, it's okay a lot of the time, honestly. So maybe that one is gonna get played a lot too. So which is a card that doesn't get played a lot that would be useful to have? Glimmer? Like Glimmer is fine, but like it's situationally very good and a lot of the times entirely useless, right? So that might be a card I want sitting around. And then this card over here for this. Okay. Seems like a pretty powerful stuff. Let's see if we survive. Like, we didn't get 20 health, which kind of sucks. Alright. No, add Scourge cards to my hand and deck. Fight! Okay, our hand is pretty slow though, so. So what is the size we need? It's 311 for this. Is that right? It's five. Yeah. That's already five. But we have to deploy it before we can shrink it. This hand is fucking garbage, too. Thing is, we have to play three cards to draw, so we need to make the decision before we have all the information. Am I planning to get rid of this? Probably. It's a lot of damage. It's bad not to play that, though. Maybe here. So you can eat more? Sure. 
just don't want it going back through my deck. Okay. Got Trample. Trample here is actually pretty good too. If they're gonna keep summoning these little shitters that add stuff to my deck, maybe Trample on this creature is better. Got our dream here. I mean, these things are killing themselves. Not quite yet. We need a little bit more spines for them to kill themselves. So trample now means I avoid two of those. I guess we could see what we're getting. So we're gonna take these, unfortunately. Actually want to, I mean, brooding this is actually fine, right? So, if it kills itself on the thorns. We want this out of here. Okay. Wombo combo, second floor. four mana to deal with and get two back from this I don't think I don't know if these count as cards played let's find out they do okay glimmer here is okay but he's currently dying so it looks like we're doing enough to go through it or rather our second attacker is so that's good so we don't have to worry about that round actually doing damage to the boss too great this thing's killing itself on thorns. We'd love to get another level of thorns. I guess a single glimmer in here will kill that and set this guy up to deal to thorns, which seems okay. And then we can zero point mind collapse to kill a unit. Uh, that unit, I guess. That unit's fine too. We're doing trample, so actually killing that unit gives us a uh, mana back. That seems okay. So the glimmer here. We zero point that. Trample through this to hit him. Two mana back from that. Generate some dudes. Alright. Dudes for this guy. Dude for the dude lord. And then we draw some more cards next turn. Okay. Seems like a pretty good turn. Oh, he just gorged four times! 28 fucking combat, or 24 combat strength, rather. So good. Final wave. He's doing 200 damage before he dies. What a fucking champ. I think multi strikes. Multi strike pretty good here. 200 damage. How many attacks is that for him? Somewhere around like six or something with the extra buffs he's got. Wonder if Thorns is better on him. Probably not. We should probably just beat it next round over there and call it a day. These guys aren't escaping. That's fine. Alright. Let's go ahead and start with this. Now we're doing 400 to him. Already is gonna be life linking, right? I think this is a double life link turn on this guy, though. Okay. Thank you, Thalliums, for the sub.
guy's been really, really solid. Oh, hi. Lost a lot of mana on this turn to do it, but we just win the fight. Dude, that's some scaling on our guy now. I tell you to buy this game, you'll buy it right now. I don't want to have that power over you, friend. I want you to be able to tune in for my stream, watch me play, ask me questions about it, and make an informed decision on your own if you like the game or not. That's what I ideally have from all of my viewers every time with a new game. 